Hey guys, this is Avkash again, and today we are going to learn about HD Insight, uh, Microsoft Hadoop uh, distribution, which is going to run on Windows Server as well as uh, Windows Client Desktop. And I have a Windows 8 machine here. It's a virtual machine, and where you will be uh, seeing that how I'm going to install uh, HD Insight on this machine. So first thing first is uh, a currently HD Insight is in customer preview or uh, it's not publicly available it's available uh, through invitation which is when HD Insight is running on Windows Azure however uh, the the CTP bits are available for those who would like to install uh, HD Insight on Windows Server as well as Windows Client if you go at Hadoop on Azure, you can see here that HD Insight is available by invitation. You can request for invitation here, and uh, if and if you really need to just go through with general, if you have access to, you see here there is a getting started Hadoop on Azure, which is here, and here you could see getting started with Microsoft HD Insight, Hello World training support forums. If you would uh, have a specific feature in your mind, I feel free to. A release notes so that's where I really look into so here what we have so the release what you are really seeing is available and uh, is it distributed on 13th of December last year 0 0.3 and in that version you see here that's running on Windows machines and there are scope is available and there is a JavaScript con JavaScript console is also available dashboard is there and there are a list of a few known issues so uh, once you have this, you can always uh, look into this uh, training. If uh, looking into, there are tutorials available for different uh, scenarios. Once you have it, and the good thing is uh, that that if you have the installed HD Insight on local machine, you can actually all take all this information knowledge and you can try there. And once you really would want to install HD Insight on your machine. What you could really do, you can just come here and at the bottom there is a link is called download HD server. And what is that? This is what is really being going to be installed on your machines. It's a hundred percent Apache Hadoop distribution comfort come okay. And it's, it's running on Windows Server as well as on Windows Azure. And you could uh, sometimes I really suggest everybody to just look into and download this uh, but this thing. And which is going to open here and you see here it just talks about the Microsoft big data the, the view how Microsoft is looking into big data overall and the solutions which Microsoft is building is going to how it's going to really uh, align with uh, the strategy which uh, all these big corporations enterprises are looking into to solve their challenges with uh, data management as well as uh, analytics from data it's a very good uh, content it's worth looking into that would be my suggestion for anybody to look into okay now we are back and we started from here so let's um, download it's gonna start the web pi and go ahead install it so here's the hd insight preview let's run it okay and i will uh, make this a content fast installed so the way is going to happen that it will be installing very fast so I will expedite it and in this uh, recording I would be uh, covering just the general introduction installation sometimes I just look into okay what these items are really going to be installed so this this, this is the list of uh, content which is going to be installed through HD Insight. So here you could see I have expanded it so you can see that HD Insight server, uh, HD Insight for Windows server is uh, and if you would really need uh, to know the direct link you can always find the link from here which is available okay and there are the different components you see here that is uh, IAS server components are installed and then dot net 4.5 extended okay and then 3.5 and then we have a hot and works data platform for windows developer preview which is installed from here 
and the C++ 2010 SP1 as well as the Python 2.7 okay so overall about 300 mega um, byte installation is available I will go ahead close it and say go ahead and install it and accept it and Once we have HD Insight is installed in our machine, there are a bunch of other things we would install, but we really do not uh, want to go further. Uh, let's go ahead, exit it. Now we have HD Insight installed in this machine. As you see, that uh, Hadoop console is available, and here we could actually run. So if I say Hadoop version uh, Hadoop 1.1. Snapshot is running right now, and there are several other things you can actually, if you would want, you can just say Hadoop information about the data node, name node. Okay, and if you uh, not only that, we can look into where this uh, installation is. So you see here that C colon Hadoop that's the snapshot is there so we can look into start so see here you could see that different Hadoop components are installed here you see that Hadoop is there Edge catalog is there Hive is there Isotope JS is there Pig is also there Scoop is there and here are the different components which related with uh, the web integration here the SDFS okay and getting installed you, you see these are the different different examples for different purposes so that you could so that's the introduction what is really being installed so here you could see that okay uh, diff, uh, these are the different components which are installed through HD Insight so we have Edge, Hadoop, Edge Catalog, Hive, Pig, Scoop and that's the different and then you see here that that's the bin folder for that if you are looking for Hive that's the hive bin folder for that so here we have Hadoop console uh, you can actually just go back and you can look into the different as uh, so uh, different folders where the different components are installed uh, just to if you would want to launch hive here is the hive console you can see here and these are the different and then uh, commands you can exit from here same thing with pig you can launch pig and here will be your your grunt shell you can actually quit from here as well okay and so you have seen here so this what is a really really very quick introduction to to Hadoop installation and next we will try to look into different uh, components related with HD Insight on Windows 8 thanks